Hey guys, today I would like to talk about what is report concept. The underlying design of the report queries of SQL accounting is different from the other system in the market. Conventionally the report menus will be like a staircase. When you pull down, if there is the most option, it means the software is better. This is the typical perception. Let's see how SQL accounting can get it done in a better way. Report. When you look at the report, you only see very few options, even you pull down, these are all the options of the reports, but how are we going to generate more 2 to 3 thousands reports, which we claim to be. Let's start from a basic report, let's say invoice listing. Sales. Print sales document listing. Whenever you go in every reporting screen, you will see the same design, a big box, and a small box. This big box is for filtering. When you view a report, you might want to see quotation listing, invoice listing. Let's see invoice listing, for all the date. For which customer, let's say for alpha and beta, when you pull down from here, then you can select one customer. When you want to select multiple customers, click at the button at the back, and then select the customer, or shift it and highlight a few customers. When I need to see these few customers which they sold to area of Subang Jaya for this project, I need a list for that. So this parameter can happen together. You can have multiple parameters. So now we untick, it means all. Then apply. There is always a grid at the bottom. Let's look at preview first because most of the people familiar with preview screen. Preview. When you preview, actually there is additional info. Click on the more details button for additional info. Whatever you see here is whatever you print because this is print preview screen. This report is always presented in the sequence of document date. How if our customers always backdated the invoice then they want a sequence of document number, the sequence of customer name, the sequence of amount, the sequence of agents and the sequence of area. Close it. So this is the small box need to do. I need it to sort by customer name in first priority. Second document number, as second sorting options. Then apply it. So you just need to manipulate this small box and you get complete second options. Preview. Here sort by customer. And here sort by document number. Thirdly, although I have a grand total of 66,000, but I might need another subtotal. Subtotal by customer, by agent, by area, by project, also as multiple parameters. Let's say I want a subtotal by agent. I click the agent and apply. Then preview. You will see subtotal by agent. Similarly, I need by area and a check on area parameter. I need a group by. Check means I need a subtotal. Preview. I need two layers of parameters, this area which agent is selling. By area, by agent. Then you check two options. Preview. Then you'll get PJ and these two agents are selling. I want to see this agent selling in which areas. Is the another way, push it up an agent. Then apply and preview it. So this is a big box and the small box replaces all the options. So although it seems like less options, but here we have a complete reporting. The grid at the bottom is to filter. For instance, I need to filter, amount more than $5,000. Then we can do custom, more than $5,000. This is the enhance filtering for grid filter. And the grid here can double click to drill down to the source document. In all the report of SQL accounting, you can always drill down. Let's go to sales. Print yearly sales analysis. For the whole year of 2019, I need to see by item sales based on amount or quantity. You can choose on the amount option or quantity option. 
We can also group by customer or by agent also using the small box. Whatever figure which is you not sure about it, just double click it. And you will see the details how system get the figure. You can further drill down also when you double click on the figure. Then you get additional screen. The drill down is very extensive. You can tap or click to get your invoice. So that whole concept of design, it'd be in this manner. Thank you. Subscribe to our YouTube for the latest video, follow our Facebook for the latest update, go to our website for reports and guides. It's so easy.